ECU's baseball team hits the road for the final time for the regular season. The Pirates play at Tulane starting tomorrow, and they have a chance to put that old G.I. Joe Kung Fu grip on the AAC regular season title. ECU is in first place by three games over UTSA with six league games to go. The Pirates are coming off back-to-back -back losses for just the second time this year, but Cliff Godwin says he could get some of his injured pitchers back this weekend. Pretty close. If they don't throw this weekend, I feel good about the next uh, next weekend. So, uh, but it'll be obviously a limited role this weekend if they throw. Doesn't want to bring them back too quick because we know they're going to make the postseason. He really wants them for that. First pitch at Tulane tomorrow night, 7:30. The Green Wave, 10 and 11 in AAC place so far this year. Here are the other weekend series we're keeping an eye on. Campbell in ninth place in the CAA. They'll be on the road at Monmouth. That's a 3 o'clock start. Well, first place in the CAA is occupied by UNCW. They host Hofstra. High point in first place in the Big South hosts Winthrop. ACC Coastal leader UNC, a big home series with Louisville. And NC State in third in the Atlantic is on the road at UVA. ECU softball team played in the second round of the AAC tournament in Wichita, Kansas. The Pirates took on the third seed North Texas. ECU swept by the Mean Green during the regular season. And they kept that trend going, ending the Pirates' year. ECU finishes its regular season with a 38-19 and record. That is an 11-win improvement from last year. Now ECU waits to see if they get in that large bid in the NCAA tournament. High school softball, Pamlico and Northside of Beaufort County getting a jump on the second round of the playoffs by playing in Bayboro tonight. They started at 6 o'clock. The two teams split during the regular season, each winning on their home field. Next up, they play the winner of Perquimans and East Bladen. That game will be Tuesday. The rest of the high school softball and baseball playoffs are tomorrow night. Former South Central High School and NCA&T baseball star Xavier Meacham already promoted in the minor leagues. The Miami Marlins moving the right-handed pitcher up from Jupiter to high A Beloit. That's in Wisconsin. Meach waiting to make his debut for the Sky Carp this season. The Charlotte Hornets announcing they have a new head coach, but he won't join the team for a while. His name is Charles Lee. He'll take over the Bugs, but he's currently the Celtics lead assistant and will stay with Boston until they finish the playoffs. The 39-year-old was also an assistant coach with the Milwaukee Bucks when they won the championship in 2021. Charles Lee replaces Steve Clifford, who went 21-61 and in his second stint with the Hornets. NHL playoffs, the Hurricanes and Rangers play game three of their playoff series tonight in Raleigh, and it just finished up. Game four will be in Raleigh Saturday night at 7 p.m. You can catch the rest of your ENC Sports on our website, WCTI12.com. I'm Brian North for News 12.